Samsung is making a comeback with the Exynos 2400 after a two-year hiatus, and this news has stirred mixed emotions among Galaxy enthusiasts. There are exciting improvements to anticipate, but there's also a drawback that might disappoint some. Compared to the older Exynos 2200, the Exynos 2400 boasts a 70% faster CPU and improved power efficiency. It also features the latest AMD graphics with RDNA 3 technology. However, surprisingly, its graphics performance falls slightly short of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 in the Galaxy S23 series. This means that the upcoming Galaxy S24 will have a graphics processor that's a bit slower than its predecessor. This development is unusual and somewhat disappointing coming from Samsung. Samsung claims that the Exynos 2400 is approximately 15% better at handling AI tasks compared to the previous year's Exynos 2200. However, in practice, it struggles to match the performance of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, let alone the anticipated powerful 8 Gen 3 in the Galaxy S24 series. In essence, Samsung's Exynos chips are not quite meeting users' expectations. The silver lining is that the Galaxy S24 Ultra will exclusively feature the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3. Nevertheless, the Exynos 2400 will be available in various regions, including Europe, Latin America, Africa, Asia, including South Korea, and India. If you reside in one of these areas, you might not experience the best performance unless you consider obtaining the Snapdragon version from other regions or opting for the Ultra model. This information is sourced from reliable reports and may disappoint users in Europe, Asia, and other regions. Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below, keeping in mind that this is based on credible sources, and circumstances may change in the future. As ardent Samsung supporters, we genuinely hope that their Exynos chips perform exceptionally well. Even the most dedicated fans can have doubts and concerns if Samsung doesn't meet expectations. The Exynos 2400 appears promising on paper, and we hope it signifies a positive step forward for Samsung's chip-making team. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button below. Peace out!